Hi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got after the closing day of March 11, 2021. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Corporate bond ETF belongs to the bear low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. There is a weak opportunity to buy healthcare sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.5%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $114.5. For call option, a possible call price is at $1.82. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell discretionary sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $162.91. For put option, a possible put price is at $4.91. Energy sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Valero Energy. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $78.19. For put option, a possible put price is at $0.84. Halliburton Company was a previous suggested put option. The striking price was bought at $23.5, and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $0.86, but we expect a possible put price of $0.87. Financial sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of financial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Real estate sector ETF belongs to the trade low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of real estate sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Simon Property Group. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 7.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $113.6. For put option, a possible put price is at $4.99. Crown Castle is a mild sell suggestion. 
It is on a trade low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 0.7%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $150.99. But we expect a possible sell price of $159. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Crown Castle. If it is over 0.10% of your stock price trade, Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the BOLO class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. There is a mild opportunity to buy Gilead Sciences. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $63.46. For call option, a possible call price is at $0.4. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Moderna Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $137.83. For put option, a possible put price is at $4.34. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrial sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Boeing Company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 5.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $249.87. For put option, a possible put price is at $2.86. 3M Company was a previous suggested put option. The striking price was bought at $182.5 and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $2.51, but we expect a possible put price at $3.83. Material sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of material sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Ecolab Incorporated was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Ecolab Incorporated is a bull normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of half a percent. You may expect now a sell return of 0.4%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $213.51. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $216.24, unless is overvalued. Discretionary Sector ETF was a previous suggested put option. The striking price was bought at $160 and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.41, but we expect a possible put price at $4.91. Let's look at the stock's table of discretionary sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Starbucks Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.3%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $107.94. For call option, a possible call price is at $1.15. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Amazon Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.5%.
you may sell it at a minimum price of $3,103.18. For put option, a possible put price is at $9.62. Consumer Staples ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of Staples sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Colgate Palmolive. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.6%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $76.62. For call option, a possible call price is at $0.61. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Costco wholesale. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.1%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $326.73. For put option, a possible put price is at $2.17. Procter & Gamble is a mild sell suggestion. It is on a trade high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 1.5%. You may expect now a sell return of 0.1%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $128.64 but we expect a possible sell price of $129.18. In addition, we Technology Sector ETF was a previous suggested put option. The striking price was bought at $129, and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $1.67 but we expect a possible put price at $4.04. Let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell advanced micro devices. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 4.2%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $79.01. For put option, a possible put price is at $2.21. Apple Incorporated was a previous suggested put option. The striking price was bought at $119, and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $2.11, but we expect a possible put price at $3.43. Intel Corporation was a previous suggested put option. The striking price was bought at $61, and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $0.96, but we expect a possible put price at $1.33. Microsoft Corporation is a mild sell suggestion. It is on a trade normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 0.3%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.3%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $236.38, but we expect a possible sell price of $240.57. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Microsoft Corporation if it is over 2.70% of your stock price trade. This is a new buy suggested put option. On the table, NVIDIA Corporation has a striking price at $510, and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $13.75, but we expect a possible put price at $7.38. Qualcomm Company is a weak sell suggestion. It is on a bare low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 3.4%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.1%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $130.08, but we expect a possible sell price of $135.24. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Qualcomm Company if it is over 4.85% of your stock price trade.
This is a new buy suggested put option. On the table, Qualcomm Company has a striking price at $131, and it will expire on March 26, 2021, exactly in 15 days. For this option, the actual put price is at $3.30 but we expect a possible put price at $1.82. Communication sector ETF belongs to the bull high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of communication sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy AT&T. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $29.55. For call option, a possible call price is at $1.09. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Comcast Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 3.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $55.4. For put option, a possible put price is at $0.54. T-Mobile US is a mild buy suggestion. It is on a trade high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 0.0%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.0%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $126.99, but we expect a possible buy price of $125.14. In addition, we suggest to stop buying T-Mobile US if it is below 0.45% of your stock price trade. Utility sector ETF belongs to the trade normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of utility sector. There is a weak opportunity to buy Southern Company. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 2.2%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $59.53. For call option, a possible call price is at $0.62. On the other hand, there is a mild opportunity to sell Dominion Energy. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.0%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $72.35. For put option, a possible put price is at $1.38. Dominion Energy was a previous top sell alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that Dominion Energy is a trade normal class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 1.0%. You may expect now a sell return of 2.0%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $70.98. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $72.43, unless it's overvalued. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good start on your trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.